What's up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Resident Evil Outbreak. So we survived the initial outbreak at Jay's bar and now we're going to below freezing point. Back to the nest from RE2. And do note you can play any of these characters in any scenario. You ain't got to play the ones I pick. So each, do keep in mind each character has their own special ability like for example Jim rarely gets attacked by enemies. George can create many types of medicines. David can create new weapons using tools. Elise says the master of locking, but the character we're playing is Yoko, who can hold more items, but there's no reason why we're playing her in this scenario. It says she's a student. That's actually a lie. She's actually an umbrella scientist. So with her, we already have access to all the parts of the lab. We ain't got to go to the ID system and do all of that. Yeah. With her, we can already just explore the entire map as much as we want. There's no turning back now. But it'll all be worth it. Hmm. Starts out with a bang for this scenario. Wish the, uh... I do like the biohazard sign, but I wish it was just like an umbrella logo or something. Gate 1. Partition is new? closed. Just wait here for a while. What's wrong with this thing? Stupid, stupid piece of junk. Oh, it's losing electric pressure. Oh, screw it. I'll, I'll just find another way out of here. Like that, she opens up the way for us. So I don't know why they thought it was a good idea to try and escape through the tunnels into a umbrella laboratory, but granted, I know George and Alyssa there don't know that this is down here, but Yoko definitely does. Ooh. Monica, I didn't expect you to return. After your little incident, I assumed that you went and hid under a rock like the little child that you are. What is that capsule? Wait, wait, are you after this too? Hmm, you are, aren't you? Oh, you are so... Stop it. I, I don't understand what you're talking about. Don't play the innocent little girl with me. You can't fool me. You could never fool me. But maybe we can work something out. Give me your ID card. Yoko, you little lifesaver. I'm so glad we had this chance to catch up. Have a nice life. What's left of it? I like how the ID card is like the same model as the one from uh, RE2. I mean, I'm not saying it's the exact same one, but well, it might be. I don't know. Hey! What? Another side note: What is with people shooting the ground around here? Ned done that like four times in RE2, and now you got her shooting the ground whenever she sees you. I'm not sure what to do. I mean, if you're going to shoot me and kill me, might as well go ahead and do it. Are you all right? 
Just shoot me in the head, take my ID card. Yours is already going up there. Jesus. Excuse me. And do you know Hi. it also depends on which character you pick, but whatever one you pick, you're gonna end up in a different part of the lab. Like hey, I think hey. Alyssa and Yoka are gonna end up in the same area, but if you pick George, I think he spawns on the second floor. I think Kevin spawns on the third floor. Like each character spawns on a different floor. Alrighty. Now that we access the nest, gonna start doing some stuff. I do need to grab a couple items so the uh, AI doesn't grab them. The AI can be really retarded when it comes to this game. Oh, come on. Hey there. Go on the ground. And a waste of a hey shot. There. Excuse me. No shit. Oh, don't need that. All right, we're gonna Just get rid of it, it anyway. Uh, I think that's Never. gonna be one of three passwords. Hmm. Not that Excuse one. Me. So let's try six, three, four. Yep. The last one's four five zero nine. Excuse me. We're gonna be entering a lot of passwords here. Oh, please tell me I didn't get rid of that. No shit. What did I drop? Or did I drop that herb? <laughs> eh, whatever. I do need to grab me a first aid spray so I can talk to the guy and get the shotgun. Stomp him. Please, no. All right, looks like he's dead. Hey. He dropped something. Oh, he did. Handgun rounds. Yep. Awesome. I think I found something. Ugh. Guessing he's dead. Not turning black or anything, so let's just hope he's dead. Hey there. Hey there. I don't need any of these chemical bottles. I could go in there. Oh, 
Oh, the memo. And that's the password to the computer. What should I do? Don't touch me. You know, Alyssa, I got an idea. How about shut up? That's what you should do. Shut up. Like the AI is just non-stop. Just do it. Calm down, little sister. Alright. People of the year. Get rid of that. I'm gonna give her the iron pipe. Hey! Alyssa, where'd you go? Come on. Come here, stupid. Take this. Use it. Huh? For the love of God. find a green herb and want to combine it. I'm going to come in here and deal with the zombie. here but this may be familiar for everybody we got Vigil remember the Plant 42 fight from uh RE1 we're gonna be using this on the Plant 43 definitely in desperate need of uh health but we'll we'll be running into some stuff that will help out with that what? i'm not using that first aid spray sorry well here's something bizarre even if i fall to the ground melissa no will just shit. pick me up just do it Uh, there shouldn't really be any enemies along the way. There we go. Shotgun guy. I brought your first aid spray. Token of his appreciation, the Excuse shotgun. Me. Help me. Hey, Alyssa, come here. Uh, here you go. Well, she swaps out to the handgun, but no shit. Just do it. I just need her and George to have those uh, pipes ready to go. I'm not even going to acknowledge that. Nope. Nope, nothing happened. We're just, we're just going to climb the ladder. 
Climb the ladder and leave this area. Meet up with George at the top. What happened? Is there a goal? Yeah, it's called getting out. I don't want to die. Hi. Right, there's a typewriter. You can save in this if you wanted to. camera. Uh -huh. Looks like no rest for the wicked. Hey there. No shit. Zombie. <laughs> He won't get up until we grab the wrench. I'm going to grab a healing item before I grab a wrench. I'm pretty sure of one hit and I'm down. Yeah, George is still alive, but he's down. Because George is apparently a moron. Oh my Come god, on, George. Is there? Hey there. What do you have? You got some handgun ammo. No, I had a red herb you could combine with that, but alright. Here, George. I know where you're going. No, hey. that's mine. Just do it. Hello there. Go away. It's mine. You had your chance and you lost it. Excuse me. There we go. Dear God. Excuse me. Go to hell. What All happened? Right. The first no one out of the way. You can open up. Oh, yep, there's shutter number seventeen. Listen. Go ahead and open the other one. Glass the first one. You want to open shutter seventeen. The other two are B four eight two and D five eight zero, I believe. What's wrong? What's wrong? Ah, it's not the first one again. Five, eight, two. Excuse me. Yep. I just had a thought. And the last Dear one is J one two six. And we need to run, grab that wrench. You don't really need to grab the wrench. You could just bash the uh, electric panels open, but it just takes too long and I'm not doing that. And I could just grab the wrench and then just run around the zombie. Grab that. What? Yep, there goes the zombie getting up. George, get out of there. You are a moron for fighting a zombie. Come on. Come on. Huh? I keep calling him. I just had a thought. Hey! Just do it! <laughs> Well, you shot a buff. Just do it. Never. And we 
can grab a magnum somewhere around here. But we need to go up to the top floor. Like a floor up. Get the magnum. We are grabbing it for, your, for the boss fight. What happened? There's a couple zombies in here I want to take care of. Yep. At least that way George doesn't take more damage as we're trying to get through this. in the hot water Hello there. that way we remove the frost although I don't know you could probably just beat it over a wall or something crack the ice off oh, there's a simple lock. antivirus this is actually really useful in case your uh, virus meter is getting like uh -huh. I wouldn't recommend it until it's like up in the 50s Excuse me. around that but Another pipe. Things first. Let's give no this. Thank you so much. Just do it. I really need to carry you, George. I, I need to. Thought. All right, you ain't grabbing that. Excuse me. George, come here. There you go. George. No, not you. Come here, George. Yes, there Thank you, you go. Much. Good boy. Hey! Hey! Fucking dipshits. Three seas of cool. Is that what he said? What's that? Just do it. All right. Dear God. So with that wrench, we can open these up. Anyone? On there. George. And I can just kip, kick him while he's down. Aha! I just had a thought. The valve could either be in this one or the one over there. No That's what we left. need. Dear God. Hey. Give me a break. Use to open this up. Although I don't really use this way. Instead, we're going to be coming back out here. And go back where we encounter Plant 43. Huh? Before it just squirted everywhere. That zombie's still alive, so I'm just going to run it for him. Come on, idiots, don't 
fuck around with the zombie. I don't need you fucking with the zombie. No shit. And this may look familiar to everybody. This is the same ladder and stuff that uh, Leon and Claire go up and down from in RE2. could be yeah pay attention to the scenario you may see stuff that you recognize I just had a thought well oh yes. did it hurt here's something peculiar Go to hell. <laughs> well here's something bizarre uh, it looks like Lisa's sticking up for it's George Telling me to go to hell. That's going to go in there for now. Hey! Please. Why are we having so much trouble to beat this guy? Go away. Down. There. Pick the shit out of him. Hey, George. Uh, hang on. Somebody could take this. You, what did you do with that? Or not, I handed the handgun to George, so... Alyssa, give me that. This is it! I just had a thought. No, not you. May I have it? This is it! Then use it! Yeah, I'm about to give it to George because no he's the only one with the freaking handgun. You have a pipe. Freaking moron. Just do it! I hear a zombie in here somewhere. Down him. Yep, he did. Hey. There we go. That's the staff memo. She picked something new. Uh, no, 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 no. I have it. Dear Come here, God. you. This is it. You ain't having that, not yet. No shit. Just do it. Y'all are either getting handguns or pipes. That's it. All the heavy weapon is mine. Speaking of heavy weapons. No, nope. Yoko. No 
No shit. Back in there. Just do it. Never. What's happening? You. I didn't think you'd come back. Blah blah blah. Your Monica's also have to sample. Dump that Dr. Birkin's die. masterpiece, you know? Magnum! Burn in hell. We're screwed. Enter there, but we can get entered through here. Excuse me. I believe it's the code lock over here. Yep, shutter lock. Hey. This may look familiar to people. may look very familiar to people. Because if we come in here, I think we enter the moth room. Hang gun rounds. Uh, may I have it? This is it. I'll give you that for these. Then use it. That way you have some ammo. And this is the terminal you need to access to uh, get the employee ID. Well, here's something bizarre. And there. I don't think we really need the wrench or the valve anymore. There is another shotgun we gotta find. I also need to grab shotgun ammo. Hey, hey! Here. Let's just stop fucking with the bugs. That we need to go up. Up again. We also need to find a blowtorch. I'm pretty sure the blowtorch is further up. I got bigger balls than most of you. <laughs> oh, really now? Do it. Where the hell is George at? I think I found something. Kind of like fucked off somewhere. things freezing your tits off oh I feel sorry for you those are hunters more specifically they're hunter R's just a stronger variant of hunter that was like manufactured by Birkin I do believe yep there is some flashy stuff in here that there's that moth there's George what does he have recovery medicine light and large I 
back here, George. All right, fine. Excuse me. Uh, I think we need to go on the blue side. I need to get away from that freaking moth. Bizarre. Tightly shut. Yeah, we need to enter this room. We find the blowtorch in here. This room probably might be recognizable to some people. This is that special room from uh, the second game. Torch. Swap that out for the. Uh oh. I've been poisoned, you idiot. Help. Help. Anyone. I feel sick. Hello. Alyssa, keep shooting him. Oh my god, Alyssa, you're taking me off here. Help me, please. No. Found some information. Oh my god, Alyssa. Help me, please. I just need one of you to down him. Thank you. Did they just take the... You motherfuckers. Of course they will. Of course you would. Yep, they took the freaking first aid spray and used it in front of me. What a bunch of D-bags. Freaking AI are constantly giving me shit. You know what? At the end of this, I'm gonna let y'all die. Y'all are gonna die. Slow, painful deaths. Each and every one of you. What if we come in here? This is where we need to use that torch we just picked up. Like that, everything's unthawed. Now it makes a lot of sense from RE2. At least somewhat. That first day's break. That first day's break. Well, Mine. Here's something bizarre. Ah, she tried to pick it up. I Go fuck yourself. Researcher's notes. You know what, uh... Well, they have like three f***ing pipes, so... George is like packing the most pipe is right now. I just saw a shotgun in there, too. Hang on. That shotgun. Got 
Because one, I'm going to need them to deal with the hunters as soon as we uh, start up the train to boss fight. What's wrong? And it's unthawing. I accidentally skipped it, but nah, it's not that big of a cutscene. Just shows the train unthawing. And the frost just coming off. We don't need that bullet torch anymore, so now well, we got another shotgun. Yes. Broken shotgun. Seeing how she turned the key, we need to hurry up and run over there. And she decided to walk. Come on, Alyssa, get out of there. Need to run over to the train area. Keep running. Don't look back. At least you made it. But with this, we just got to hold out. You got a timer up on the top, and you also got to make sure your AI, AI companions stay on the freaking lift. Look at that hunter. Remember, you morons are on your own. Here's something peculiar. Go to hell. What happened? We're going to stay here. Dear God. Just do it. 
We got one minute left. Stay here. Don't move. While we wait, I'm gonna go ahead and start popping this stuff in my uh So that'd probably be stupid. Just hope that this is good enough. Just had a thought. Up we go. God, it's another ugly baby. Bit of a breather. <laughs> oh, it's nice to be in the same lift that uh, Leon, Claire, and Sherry will be riding in later. Although I'm pretty sure, like, a uh, fall outbreak takes place Over there. right at the start of the outbreak of Raccoon City. Damn. Now it has evolved into a G-Mutant. Though, this tends to be one of the easiest bosses in the game. As long as you don't like let off the uh, pressure and just keep shooting him. Do. Pay no mind to the little fuckers. Think that was it? Yep, down he goes. To be continued. I could probably just leave off, leave off the episode there. <laughs> eh, see you, Rank. Not normal. Event completion rate fifty nine percent. I said I'm not trying to aim for any uh, A ranks or S ranks or nothing like that. The high- oh my god, this is one of the worst ones. 
The hive scenario is one of the worst, but we'll be tackling that one next. Oh, hospital transforms some kind of hive full of squirming things. We push on and push the repulsive image from our minds. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end the episode here. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe as always. And until next time, have a good day.